All Progressive Congress for Edo State don't hold meeting with the leaders from the three senatorial districts for Edo State. This meeting went on Friday for Benin City and can see happen behind closed doors now for APC to strategize and plan ahead to deliver all their candidates for the 2023 general election. Former Governor of Edo State and former APC National Chairman, Comrade Adam Soshomoli, Yan Tori people after the meeting say this meeting has to remind the leaders of their role for their unit, ward, local government and the state. A constant and say this campaign not be about to share money, but to talk about the good story of Asiwaju Bola Ahmed Tinubu to the people of Edo State and constant and some of the achievements of this present APC government. The whole idea is to, like you said, to remind each and every one of us that first, your name doesn't have to be on the campaign council to realize that you have a duty to campaign. In Edo State, we have over 4,000 polling units. And we are supposed and we will reach each of those over 4,000 polling units. So in every polling unit, people will be there campaigning. In every ward, people will be there, in every local government, and of course at the state level and the national level. So we need to explain this because sometimes people may misunderstand. If your name is not on the campaign council, you might say, okay, that means I don't have responsibility. You even have huge responsibility. And even me, that I am named as a Deputy Director General of the campaign, my first, un my first priority is my unit, then my ward, then my local government, and then our state and Nigeria. It will not be good news if I don't win my unit. So we have to emphasize that to people. And I think people are now much, much clearer. You know, um, this is also relevant not only for Edo people across the country. Because people are struggling, they want to be Kapi, Kasu, Kapi. Everybody is a Kapi manager. But we cannot put all the names. So I think people are reasonably, people are satisfied. We also have to let people know that this is not about sharing money. It's about spreading a message. You know, and our candidate has a lot that is going for him. In terms of going forward, because everybody is going to make promises. Everybody will say he will transform Nigeria to heaven, he will transform uh, uh, XYZ. But we're asking uh, the three main candidates that people talk about, they've all been in government. And uh, who are the people that whose life have changed because somebody was governor there? Uh, in Edamawa, uh, some people were vice presidents. What has changed other than one man has a university, the other people are in, the, in Lagos. We can even speak of what is happening now. A young lawyer picked up, identified, and all the successive governors of Lagos, they are first class. That did not happen by accident. It happened through a carefully thought out leadership, political leadership recruitment process. And that is what is missing in many parts of Africa. That is why you see one government come, he start a project, another government come and abandon it. The example of Lagos, beginning with Asiwaju, is that because there is a shared vision within the APC family, governors after governors add their own bit to actualize that vision. And that explains what Lagos is today compared to what it was in 1999. And that is the thing we are telling them, that they have a huge message to sell. But also to remind people that whether they like it or not, Buhari built River Niger Bridge. He will commission it. And during the campaign, even our opponent will be driving, you know, across that river, across that bridge. And there are several other things. The renewed emphasis on agriculture, reminding us that food security cannot be wished away. We should go back to the land. You know, there are a couple of things here and there, but this election is about the future. And uh, we have to let our people know what the campaign messages are at the moment. And by the time our manifesto is formally released, because the difference between us, for those who are asking, is that one man does not go and write a manifesto and read it out. Once the manifesto is ready, it's debated by an appropriate organ of the party and approved, it becomes a shared basis for approaching the campaign. Comrade Oshomoli, when he contest as APC senatorial candidate for Edo North, talks say him role for Tinubu campaign council, no go affect the campaign to be senator at all. Oshomoli, when he talks to Edo people, no say him perform well as governor, 
constant talk say people don't already they do the campaign for him sake of the Ogbonge work when he do for Edo State. I ran a lecture here across Iti local government, you remember? And uh, I did so twice. The second time I'm humbled by the outcome. It is 6.4 percent. So that is a local government. Now I'm going to contest for Senate, which covers only six local government. You really think that that is enough for me? That would be huge on that capacity utilization. So and don't re also remember that it's not a one-man business. Everybody in a do not, in fact, in a do state can campaign for me, and they are campaigning for me. And how are they doing it? They just remind people that I'm not a stranger to their homes. I'm not a stranger to their neighborhood. They can look at the red roofs. They can look at the roads we build. We didn't build roads that wash away every season. The roads are still there. We build a university that uh, when every other place is closed, it's, it's functioning. That is a result of a clear vision. So people are doing the campaign for me already. All I need to do is to just make myself available. And the uh, campaign is done. But remember, the fact that you are fighting for an Iroko tree eh, doesn't mean you are ignoring the grasses around it. APC Chamo for the state, Colonel David Dimuse retired, constantly choke mouth for the outcome of the meeting. It was a purely family affair. We came here to strategize on ways of our party winning the forthcoming elections from the presidential, senatorial, uh, House of Representatives, and House of Assembly elections. And it went very well. And by the grace of God, we we'll deliver all our candidates, starting from the president, Bola Amen, Asiwaju. Omo Aluki Ajakaye, TMC TV News. Don't forget to say your PVC, not be your power. Not say I'm giving any politician on election day.